All right, children, welcome back to my Let's Play Dragon, uh, Quest Warrior. I uh, still haven't figured out what, uh, okay, let's just go ahead and use this. Okay, you actually don't have to use the door, uh, thing or whatever. Considering how few doors there are, it is weird that they, uh, decided to use one of the eight, uh, commands or whatever for it. Yeah, I still haven't decided what to, like, what to call it. I mean, it's technically Dragon Quest, right? But then the, uh, the cartridge, uh, says Dragon Warrior. See, so, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I hate people. Go, leave me. All right, well, you're out in public of your own accord, so sometimes when you go out in public, you gotta be around people, so shut up. Uh, once there was a town called Hawksness, far to the south, but wait, I've already seen that person too, I think, right? I suggest making a map if thy path leads uh, into the darkness. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm not gonna have to do that, I hope. They say that Erdrick's armor was hidden long ago. Okay, give me stuff. Found the torch, okay, don't really need that. 11 gold, oh, come on, man. Uh, the herb, okay. Well, I guess the herb's the best thing out of that uh, bunch. I mean, I guess that it was like low effort treasures, so I guess I can't expect them to have good stuff in them. I'm too busy, ask the other guard. Oh, let me guess, this guy's gonna say the same thing. Yeah, yeah, okay, see. I, yeah, I remember a lot of the keys, like, not being useful. Hmm. How come there's no... Huh, alright. I had a suspicion that there'd be... Wait, is there a ship down here? Am I remembering that right? The harp at attracts enemies. Stray away from the... Stay away from the Graven Garenham? Alright, I guess not. Oops. Aw, oh, dang it, I... <laughs> Ah, uh, oh, I have to use another key too. <laughs> God dang it. Oh, man. Okay, come on. Okay, you gotta step on the stairs and then hit the, uh, hit the button. All right, fine. Oh, wait, we can grab another herb. Ah, uh, yeah, see, that's what kept happening. I think it says it's empty if you already have six. Cause that's what I noticed. I noticed that I grabbed the herb a bunch of times. And then at one point it was just like gone, but then the other chest still had stuff in them. So I was like, maybe I just uh, was maxed out. Okay. Uh, stairs. Okay, cool. Oh great, we got a dungeon. Um. All right, well let's uh let's check it out. Oh my gosh. Oh man, another episode of this shenan kind of shenanigans. All right, what do we got? Warlock. Oh man, get out of here. Oh man. Okay, so yeah, I don't uh, know what's down here, but. Oh wait, is the harp down here? Is that why the dude standing outside mentioned it? Maybe we're strong enough. I mean, we appear to be strong enough to be here, but hopefully the enemies on like the next floor aren't gonna be uh, like too tough or whatever. Okay, I almost don't even wanna fight these guys. Especially when I know that they can. Can that one cast hurt? Yeah, I don't remember. Oh man, what's up with the slideshow? Jeez. It's like 10 FPS's uh, when you're in the underground area or whatever. Or in the... What are we in? We're not in a cave, right? It's like an underground tunnel or something, right? Um... Okay, treasure, noise, I guess. Well, I guess one of these treasures could have the uh, the harp in it, so I probably should go for it. Is he gonna C-block me right at the end? No? All right. All right, so what do we got? Uh, empty, okay, so that was probably an herb. Six gold, come on, man. It's not even worth programming a treasure chest to be there. Um, all right. Let's get our vision back. Okay, I mean, oh man, okay, glad I had a, oh man, what if I don't have enough keys and I just don't realize it yet? Well, I guess the game won't let you get like trapped, I hope. All right, so why do they give you a, uh... Why do they give you a torch, I wonder? 
you would obviously have the um the radiance spell by now, right? Oh my goodness. I guess I shouldn't stand still. I wonder if you lose the vision based on how many steps you take or if it's uh, based on time, if it's on a timer, you know? Oh, by the way, remember how in the last episode I mentioned that I, uh, like, made history by, like, losing sleep by grinding? Uh, I made history again. Uh, actually, I was going to say this. Well, I don't know. I'm losing track of, like, which episode's which, but in yesterday's episode I was going to say it, but I didn't get around to it. That's kind of how it goes. A lot of times I'll like think of stuff to talk about, but then like when the camera's going or whatever, or when the videos, or when I'm making the video, I actually don't get around to it. Uh, the cursed belt. Um, I can throw away the torch. I don't even know if I need that. Do I have to uh, bring the cursed belt to someone to have them uh, remove the curse? I wonder. I don't know. I ain't putting it on. I ain't putting on something that says cursed. I've played enough video games, you put a curse thing on and now you can't take it off. And it makes you miss 90% of the time or some shit, you know? But uh, yeah, I was going to say this yesterday, but um, uh, I set, or I had another historic moment. Uh, I I wiped my ass while uh, while driving for the first time. Uh, I, I like took a dump before leaving for yoga. And then it was one, man, it was one of those, like, do you ever have it where, oh man, a specter. Do you ever have it where it's like you poop and then you're like done wiping and then like right before you get up, you have that one little extra bit of poop where it's like not even enough for it to like plop down. It's just enough to like, it's just like a dollop of poop on your butthole. Oh, God dang it. Uh, kind of like, um, like when cake decorators like have the icing in that uh, in that squeeze bag or whatever and then they have like that metal tip or whatever and like they squeeze it or whatever to make the icing come out and then they dab it onto the cake or whatever to make like to make little um little decorations or whatever on it it was kind of like that I was like god dang it dude oh, so I had to wipe that and I was kind of like and then that was kind of like it was like you know it was kind of soft so I was like okay well that sucks but I am leaving for yoga right now so what are the odds that I'm gonna need to poop again oh my gosh I don't like this place so uh, so I'm driving and I feel a fart and a thing that happens when you go to yoga is like with like something about going into child's pose at the beginning of the practice makes every fart for the last six days or for the next six days, just like rush your freaking sphincter, and you gotta sit there and you gotta hold it, like, for the entire class, you know? Sometimes it goes away, like the urge goes away. Oh, there's like no way to keep, is, is there no way to keep track of like where I am? Should I just try to keep going down the stairs and, and avoid the upstairs? The upstairs is or whatever? So basically, any farts that I can get out of my system before practice, like, you want to get as many of as you can. That way you're not, like, uncomfortable. I mean, like, there's there's poses where it, like, pre it, like pushes, like, on your, like, intestines and stuff. So you don't want, uh, you know, you don't want, like, pockets of air, you know? Okay, 2078. Good golly. Alright, well, the gold has gone up a bit. I'm guessing they're probably going to want me to have the, uh, enough for the... Oh jeez, I shouldn't have done that. Uh, they, they're gonna want me to have the uh, the magic armor pretty soon, right? Probably. Okay, I guess the good news is that this guy isn't uh, too tough. Yeah, I don't know. I just I saw my HP. Was the first heal like a really good heal? I'm not entirely sure. I'm just in the habit of like doing double heals. Oh, wait, is that um that dude is pallet swapped and he's also like facing the other direction isn't he wasn't the other one facing the uh, opposite direction all right we got to cast the uh the thing again all right it's fine okay i gotta make sure to not go to like not use all my mp i gotta save some mp so i can cast outside but anyway so you, you want to get as many of your farts out as you can before practice that way you minimize the chance of being like uncomfortable you know and so i'm driving and i feel and i feel one i'm like all right sweet i'm actually you know actually when you're driving 
to yoga, you actually want to fart, you know? So I'm like, all right, sweet. I can, I got, like, there's one coming. Like, any fart I let out now is one less fart that's going to be, like, making me uncomfortable during class. A treasure, all right, cool. Oh, wait, this is in a single room. Is this going to be the one? Uh, found the silver harp. All right, cool. Oh, I got to get rid of something? Um... I almost don't want to get rid- well... Kind of want to get- well... You know what, I don't know what the dragon scale does. Does it give you like one defense? And the fighter's ring gives you like one attack? I actually don't know. I'll just get rid of this, I guess. Okay, so how long is that going to be taking up space in my uh, inventory, I wonder? Like, are we gonna like ever are we gonna use it and clear that space up again? I wonder. But anyway, what I was trying to get to is that uh, I was driving to work, or not to work to to yoga. I felt a fart, and I was like, okay, great, sweet, I can let this guy go. And keep in mind, I just previously had a soft poo, so I was like being careful. Like I was like I you know I'm not stupid. I remembered. I was like, okay, let's be careful with this one. And apparently, like, you're, like, I don't know, our, our our bodies are pretty smart. Like, a lot of times, if, like, you're, like, pushing, 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 and then, like, the alarm goes off and, like, the bear trap shuts. And that's exactly what happened. And, but then I was like, wait, did it shut in time or did anything come out? Like, I wasn't sure. Like, nor I mean, normally it's not, like, a super big deal. Like, if you have it where, if you have it where the poop, like, it, like gets past your sphincter but it doesn't like escape the cheeks you know uh it's usually not like a super big deal like if you have to go in public because like it like if it's in between your cheeks the smell like won't come out because it's trapped it's, it's still trapped like inside your butt cheeks or whatever but uh but with yoga you do a lot of poses where you're like got your legs apart and you're like you know like if you do like a warrior two like your one cheeks pulling in one direction and your other cheeks pull pulling in another direction so that's one of the poses where if you have to fart and you're in a warrior two, like the pose, like you're literally pulling your butt cheeks apart from each other, and that's not the position you want to be in when you're trying to when you're trying to hold a fart in, you know. So I was like, okay, well, well, Wraith Knight, uh, almost, uh, let me. I kind of don't want to fight him if I'm not at full. Let's go ahead and heal. If I run into another one, I'll fight him. So am I going back upstairs to get out of here? Man, should I just use, uh, escape or whatever? Should I just, um... Should I just use outside? Oh, man, 11? I will hope... I mean, I did 17. That's pretty good. Holy shnikes. Ah, I gotta run. God dang it, dude. Let's just, uh... Let's just get out of here. Was that six magic, by the way? Alright, what does this guy have to say? The harp attracts enemies? Stay away from the grave and okay, so is this is this like the game trying to tell me that I have to go to the grave and then use the harp and it'll attract an enemy that I have to kill? Hmm. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. But uh yeah, I so I you know, I've got athletic pants on. And I'm like, okay, well I you know, and I have like napkins in the side compartment uh, of my you know, of the driver's seat or whatever. Or the driver's side door, that little compartment or whatever. So I was like, well, F it, and reached in, grabbed a napkin, reached down, and nope, we were good to go. There was actually nothing there. I was like, all right, cool. Uh, I did, sometimes, if if I'm just, like, wiping crumbs, like, off my face, like, I'll reuse the napkin. I had to make sure to, uh, <laughs> I had to make sure to put that napkin, like, a, a, I had to, like, get that out of there. That way I wouldn't put it back with the other napkins and then, like, lose track of which napkin it was and accidentally wipe my face with it later. Um, okay, anyway, so we got the harp. Uh, I don't know what to do now, though. We could go, we could go to that, um, we could go across that bridge all the way on the other side. Let's, uh, let's do that. Okay, let's see what we got down here. I did peek down uh, past this bridge, uh, off camera. I came to about here. I saw the, uh, I saw the staircase. And, uh, I had a, I had a, what could be false memory, but I remember, um, or from what I remember, which may or may not be accurate or whatever, um, Oh, excuse me. I think this is the place that you have to go to when, um, oh yeah, you get a lot of gold, but not very much experience. I mean, I'm not gonna go out of my way to farm with that. I mean, 
Yeah, I don't know. I feel like if you're going to grind, you would want to be getting experience with your gold, you know? I feel like just fighting the, like those enemies that I was fighting earlier would be a better use of my time, you know? Because I get uh, experience as well. But uh, yeah, what I was trying to say is that I think this is the area that you have to go to when you have the the uh, the rain and the sun item, and then you get the then you get the. Do you combine them or I don't know what you do? You do something with them, and then you get uh, maybe is, do you get the item that lets you create the rainbow bridge? Maybe. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. I'm pretty sure that whatever is here, we're not going to be able to do anything. Like we're gonna have to come back. Oh man, I also totally forgot about that uh, that place towards the beginning of the game. Remember that uh, that cave that had the fort that was like surrounded with all the forest, and we got uh, turned back around as soon as we went in there. It was a cave. It was sort of like this, where there was like an old dude standing in in the way. Uh, in thy task, thou hast failed. Alas, I feel thou art not thou art not the one Erdrick predicted would save us. Go now, bro. Uh. Okay, so just because I don't have your thing, it's no reason to be a jerk, uh, senor Mr. Man. Uh, okay, now what? Um, we can go... Okay, we have to take the... The harp... We have to take the harp to the grave, right? Oh, does, does this mean I have to go into that stupid town that, uh, that killed me? I mean, I guess I am stronger, but... But I don't know if I'm that I don't know if I'm that strong. I mean I can take on the wyverns like kinda okay. But if they're already gonna be like making me fight like a uh, like a pallet swap, that's probably gonna be like out of my league. Oh, I don't know, maybe the game wants me to farm goldmen until uh until I can afford the magic armor. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, I'm tempted to just use a wings. I did use a wings uh, by mistake. I meant to use the Gwalen's love or whatever, but then like I miskeyed or whatever and accidentally used the wings. It was before I started uh, recording. Actually, you know what? Let me check the store. If I can buy wings from this store, maybe I'll just, well, we're kind of getting to the point where like 70 for the wings is expensive, but like it'll save time on like walking. And if I need to go back to the left side of the map, then you know screw it you know it's gonna be like it's gonna turn into where it's like i'm gonna be getting like 70 gold in like one fight so it's not gonna be uh that big a deal so let's uh let's meet back and uh let's see what's um on the left side and then like down or whatever oh yeah i also forgot that uh this door is here let's take a look i have just enough keys to open them all right uh good day i'm howard four steps south of the bath and call thou shalt find a magic item oh great how am I supposed to remember that? South of the Bath and Call? Have I been to Call yet? South of the Bath. Oh, it's not ringing a, it's not ringing a bell. What if I've already been there? Oh man, hopefully I don't need whatever that item is. All right, a wings. All right, sweet. Okay, what what am I gonna get rid of? I'll get rid of more fairy water, I guess. I don't know. I should probably get rid of the dragon, uh, the dragon scale or the fighter's ring, but I don't know what those do. I mean, I guess the one thing I can find, I can like farm them in the one place, and the dragon scale was only um, 20, so I guess it's not that big a deal. But okay, across the bridge we go. Uh, every time I've crossed this bridge, nothing good uh, happened. Okay, we got wraith knights. Uh, man, 19, man, that's a lot, man. Alright, let's see what we got. Uh, Demon Knight. Oh, man. He's just a black silhouette. It's kind of spooky, actually. Okay, at least it didn't, uh, it didn't do, like, 800 damage or something like that. I thought maybe it was, like, a thing that you have, like, a low probability of running into, but he, like, pushes your face in or something. Okay, I'm just gonna, uh, run from this guy, too. I could probably defeat him, but... I'm trying to, like, explore, and any fighting I do is just going to wear me down. Okay, so we have wyverns, and we have, uh, the, uh, the... Ooh, metal slime. God dang it. <laughs> so we have the, uh, the wyvern slimes, and then the, uh, the wraith, uh, skeleton dudes or whatever, and these guys. So that's a, that's a wide range of, um... 
Hmm, okay. Definitely not going across that bridge. Alright, let's see if we can uh, take out this guy. Actually, I actually don't remember how much the metal slimes give in the uh, in the first game. Wait, would it be nice if it was a thousand? Oh, you son of a bitch. So we have things that I can defeat and then things that can handily defeat me in the same area. Okay, shoot. At least uh, I seem to be able to run pretty easily most of the time. <laughs> oh, come on, man. I'm guessing that, um... Oh, big boy. Almost, well, let's see how much damage he does. Uh, okay, I think we need to get out of here. Man, another bridge. Um, let's stay on this side. Let's check the, uh, let's check the town. I think I've, I think I've wandered into the next, um, like the next level of difficult enemies. Or, you know, the next level of, of strength tier of enemies or whatever, you know what I mean, right? Let's just do what the game wants and, uh, and go in here. Speaking of doing what the game wants, I actually don't think that it's probably going to be, uh, yeah, way back when, earlier in the game, I was like, oh, you can, like, save money by, uh, like, leapfrogging, like, weapons and armor and stuff. It's like, man, I don't think the game really wants you to do that. I mean, you could, but it's just going to make you have to grind like crazy uh, to do it. Like, it's not worth, I think they price the items to make it, like, not worth it to do it. Alright. Oh, come on, man. Yeah, this is the dude. Oh, 22. God dang, dude. Oh, man. 24. Dude. Welp. Well, guess who's got some grinding to do? God dang, dude. Okay, well, the good news is that I can go to, um... Oh man, only 606 for a level. All right, well, I'm probably gonna gain two levels and get the magic armor and we'll meet back and we'll try that again. Uh, I'm pretty sure that, I think, that, I mean, it would make sense that the town is the next thing we have to do, but I can go into that bottom floor uh, where I was fighting the uh, the enemies that were like reasonable that I could uh, that I could grind on, that give a pretty good amount of experience and gold and also um, like they're not super hard either. Um, so, uh, yeah, I guess we'll do that, and we'll meet back in the next one and hopefully make it through. So, uh, yeah, that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, please drop a like on this video, and I want to say thanks to the people that have been liking the videos and commenting and whatnot. I really appreciate it. And, um, yeah, I'm honored that you all like watching me do this. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. Take care. Bye.